Country music icon Alan Jackson has announced that he will be retiring from touring due to health concerns, capping off his storied career with a farewell tour named Last Call, One More for the Road. Jackson, 65, shared in a heartfelt video on X that after over three decades of performing across the globe, he feels it's time to focus more on family time, particularly with his three daughters and grandchildren, as he navigates his twilight years. The Chattahoochee singer revealed that his decision is partly influenced by his battle with charcot Mary tooth disease, a genetic condition that impairs muscle control and has increasingly affected his mobility. This health issue has already forced him to postpone performances, and Jackson expressed that it has made performing on stage increasingly uncomfortable. Jackson, a two-time Grammy winner and a member of the Country Music Hall of Fame, initially shared his diagnosis publicly in a 2021 interview on the Today Show with Jenna Bush Hager. He explained that making his health struggles known was a relief, as it helped fans understand his recent onstage difficulties, which included maintaining balance. His final tour will see him performing in cities such as Boston, Grand Rapids, Fayetteville, Kansas City, Salt Lake City, Oklahoma City, Fort Worth, Orlando, Tampa, and Milwaukee, with tickets having gone on sale recently. This tour marks the end of an era for Jackson and his fans, offering a last chance to see the country legend perform live. Country music's Alan Jackson is hanging up his cowboy hat, announcing his final tour dates while his health is getting worse. I've been touring for over 30 years, you know, played everywhere in the country and parts of the world, and had a wonderful career, he said in a video posted on X, announcing the final dates of his last call. One more for the road farewell tour. The Chattahoochee singer, 65, cited a desire to spend more time with family, in particular, his three daughters and his grandchildren, as he enters his twilight years. I enjoy spending more time at home and don't want to be away like I had to be in my younger days, he said. I think it's just getting time to start thinking about hanging it up full time. Another factor in Jackson's decision was his diagnosis with charcot Mary tooth disease a genetic neurological condition that affects muscle control in the feet and hands. The condition is not fatal, but can severely restrict mobility, according to the Cleveland Clinic. The singer has had to postpone shows in order to deal with related health issues, notably halting a multi-show outing in 2022 to deal with health issues stemming from the disease. Most of my fans know I have a degenerative health condition that affects my legs and arms and my mobility, the two-time Grammy winner explained in this week's video. And it's getting worse. It makes me more uncomfortable on stage, and I just have a hard time. I just want to think about maybe calling it quits before I'm unable to do the job like I want to, he concluded. The Country Music Hall of Fame member revealed his diagnosis in a 2021 interview on Today explaining that he decided to make the information public because it was beginning to visibly affect his performances. I just wanted the fans and the public to know if they've come to see me in the last few years or if they come to see me in the future if I play anymore. What's going on? He told co-host Jenna Bush Hager. In some ways, disclosing the condition is a relief because I was starting to get so self-conscious up there about stumbling around, he said. And it just made me nervous up there trying to keep my balance. And I look pitiful. So I think it'll be good for me now to get it out in the open. And so if anybody's curious why I don't walk right, that's why. At the time, the entertainer said he had no plans to stop touring, but that his health condition might affect his availability. Jackson's final shows will be played from August to May in Boston, Grand Rapids, Mitch, Fayetteville, Arc. Kansas City, Mo, Salt Lake City, Oklahoma City, Fort Worth, Texas, Orlando, and Tampa, Fla, and Milwaukee. Tickets went on sale Friday. As Alan Jackson prepares to draw the curtain on his illustrious touring career, fans have a final opportunity to experience the magic of his performances across various cities from August to May, with shows scheduled in locations like Boston, Grand Rapids, Fayetteville, Kansas City, 
Salt Lake City, Oklahoma City, Fort Worth, Orlando, Tampa, and Milwaukee. This farewell tour promises to be a memorable celebration of Jackson's three-decade-spanning journey in country music. In his decision to retire from touring, Jackson prioritizes his family and health, emphasizing the importance of his personal well-being over continuing his performing career. Despite the challenges posed by Charcot Mary Tooth disease, Jackson remains a beloved figure whose contributions to country music will continue to resonate with fans around the world. As tickets go on sale, fans are encouraged to seize this last chance to see the Country Music Hall of Fame member live, ensuring they can partake in the final echoes of a legendary career. Alan Jackson's Last Call One more for the road tour is not just a series of concerts, but a poignant farewell from one of country music's most enduring voices.